Random drug testing for 7th to 12th graders. It's a new policy in a Nebraska school district and it's raising eyebrows. 3 News reporter Ron Johnson has more. Ron, good morning. Good morning, Zach and Cerise. It's for students who participate in school-sponsored competitive extracurricular activities in the Crete District. It's also for any high schooler who wants to park in the school's lot. The school board passed it at their meeting in July. The board says it comes after an increase in what they called instances both on and off school property. The community questioned the board on what exactly led to the policy, the transparency behind the approval, and the concerns for safety of student information. Once these kids do get tested, where is that data going to? Who is going to, what third, I know it's a third party. Who's doing the testing? What information are they going to have on my kid? That's my biggest concern. We believe that this is in the best interest of our students at this time to provide them a safe, uh, positive learning environment. That's why it was adopted. Again, you may disagree with that. Now the policy uses a third party for testing referred to as Sport Safe Testing Services Incorporated. The urine sample testing will take place twice a month and is a requirement to participate in extracurricular activities. Both the parent and the student need to sign it. The board pointed to the community uh, to frequently ask questions page on the district's website for some answers, but they did acknowledge that some of the questions asked had not been addressed. In the studio this morning, Ron Johnson, 3 News Now.